A decade ago, Schalke was in the Champions League semi-finals, but this season they've suffered their second relegation in the last three years. So what happened to Schalke? Most football clubs in Germany follow the 50 plus 1 rule, but Schalke is 100% owned by their fans, so although Schalke is the second most popular club in Germany, it's hard for them to raise funds without an outside investor. The club has been in debt since they completed the Veltens Arena in 2001. To help their debt Schalke has sold academy players, and consistently qualified for Europe. But everything changed in 2016. Tired of the success of their rivals Dortmund, club chairman, billionaire Clemens Tunnies, broke Schalke's sustainable model. Over the next two and a half years, Schalke spent over 150 million euros, breaking their transfer record three times. At the same time many key players left on free transfers. Schalke's new signings flopped, and the club has qualified for Europe once since then. This killed Schalke financially, and with no matchday revenue during the pandemic, Schalke was broke even though.